there guys, what is up? The Android Mine here and welcome back to another video. So today I will be showing you how to install a custom map onto Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now it doesn't matter what version of Minecraft you are using, this method will work for you unless in the future they update it and it's completely different, but it should work for you. I'm using the 0.16.0 beta, but that doesn't matter at all. It still works completely the same as it would do for a version of Minecraft that isn't the beta. So the only thing that you will need for this this tutorial is a file explorer. Now I'm using ES file explorer, you can use any of them, but if you'd like to follow along the tutorial step by step, I would suggest that you use the same file manager that I am using. So let's go ahead and get into the video. So the first thing that you'll need to do is go over to Google Chrome or Google, whatever sort of internet browser, and you'll need to search up for a map. Now the website that I use is called MCPEDL, I'll leave a link down below to that, and then you go here and then you press maps and then you choose what sort of map it is that you'd want so I'm gonna go ahead and go on to let's go on to redstone creations um, and then we'll find a map and then we will download it so you can see here there's a map here called five call auto smelters and then in brackets it says redstone I've made a video on this map already and um, I'm gonna go ahead and download this one just as an example so what you'd go ahead and do is you would click on the name of the map and then you would wait for to load and then you can read about it if you really want to and then you scroll down and there should be a download button now sometimes there may be more than one download button um, depending on the version of Minecraft that you are using so make sure that you download the one that is correct for you so you go ahead and hit download and it should take you to Mediafire or it should take you to Dropbox or someplace like that go ahead and hit download and then your download will start as you can see and then it will be done like so once your download is complete Complete, go ahead and open up ES File Explorer, go over to these three little lines here, go over to Downloads, and then you should see a zip file that contains your map. So go ahead and open up the zip file by just holding down on it, um, and then going to these three little dots here, and then press Extract To, and then press Extract To 5 Cool Auto Smelters, or whatever the name of the map is. Press OK, and then it will extract into a folder like so. And sometimes you will get more than one folder. So if you click inside of the folder, and there's another one, just click in it, and what you want to go ahead and do is, and copy the second folder, press Copy. Go ahead to the three lines here, go ahead to Home, and then go ahead and scroll down to games. It should have the Minecraft logo. Then go ahead to com.mojang and then go into Minecraft Worlds and then press paste and your world will be pasted. And then you can go ahead and open up Minecraft, which I'll go ahead and do and I'll meet you guys in Minecraft. Okay guys, so I am now in Minecraft and if I go ahead and press play, there you can see the five cool auto smelters map that I just installed into the game. And it's so simple guys, you should definitely go ahead and do this if you are one to use any maps because this is the only way that I figured out to do it and um, this will only work for Android if you are on iOS you have to use um, I think you have to be jailbroken I'm not too sure but there may be video out there for iOS users um, and if there is I will link it down below if I can find a good tutorial but I don't use iOS so I can't show you how to do that so this is only for Android but yeah as you can see the map will work completely fine and it's pretty cool so go ahead and leave a like on this video if you did enjoy it and it helped you out and i will see you guys in the next one stay awesome see ya bye bye